Now, let's treat this viral online post that you always, we always come across online. Is it okay for you as a married person to keep contact with your ex? Now, I keep hearing some people saying, my ex is not my enemy. My ex is not my enemy. My ex is this. My ex is that. As a matter of fact, if you were into a relationship that you don't work at, and you both move on, you are no one's exes. God did not destine both of you together. That is the reason both of you did not end up. So why do you want to keep contact with your past? Why do you want to keep contact with your exes? If you keep contact with your exes, you are only treading a dangerous path. You might have moved on completely, but your ex might have not. It is a dangerous path to tread because your partner might be insecure. Okay, let's take it like this. How would you feel as a person if your wife or your husband is keeping contact with your exes? Will you be happy? Whatever is your answer, you have to think of the other person. Old flame. Old flame is not difficult to spark. A path you have tried before, a path you have walked before, it's not difficult for you to walk past it again. It can break your own. Yes, it can cause problem. It can cause lack of concentration. It can bring comparison. Yes, you begin to compare. It might, it might bring lack of focus. That you will not be able to focus on your relationship or marriage. As a result of keeping contact with your exes. Don't forget this emotional cheating. By the time you keep talking with your hairs, sharing things together, oh, you remember, you remember, emotional cheating sets in. The Bible condemns emotional cheating. You don't need to cheat with your body, but that thought in your heart is already emotional cheating. It is a dangerous path to tread. If you come across your ass on the road, you can say hello, you can greet. But constant communication, keeping their contact, writing, calling them just to check on them, just to see how they are doing, it's a dangerous path. You should never tread because it has never ends away. As a matter of fact, if you were once in a relationship that never worked away, everyone has moved on, no one is your essence. Your destiny, you're not tied together. So that's the reason both of you did not end up as a couple. Now that you are married to another person, you have to concentrate. You have to focus. Yes, you have to concentrate. And focus. So for me, I will say, don't keep contact with your hairs. If you see them on the way, you can greet them. Communicating, calling, writing messages is a no, no. S, you want to break your home? 